Muddy Gaming here. Let's put my headset on. If I don't drop it first. And I am now in a Cobra Mark III, I believe. This is the new Wings update for Elite. Now, I'm not playing it on uh, the grander scale of multiple pilots. I'm still doing the solo thing. Just getting used to it. Um, oh, I forgot to mute my uh, Twitch stream. So, here we go. Right, so, should be all good now. Might be a bit bright. Let's try and get it down a bit. Yeah, the light level's much more acceptable now. I think that's probably it. Right, so. Oh, this is not going to be good, is it? Here we go. Try and get back into it. Try and get comfortable before I start streaming. Sorry, guys. There we go. Right, so, in the Cobra Mark III, I've just uh, passed this, well, changed this out from a, what was I flying before, Viper, just because it's a bit more versatile. Apparently there's been a good few updates, one of them is the fact that I can now um, I can now do bounties with other people. Look forward to that because I've got a few mates in uh, Australia that I've been playing this game with and that we couldn't actually Ready to engage. share bounties or anything which was a bit annoying. But Hopefully they are sort of that now. business right so I need to be up there I might stick with this ship for a while because I can get the cargo bay up to 60 tons which means I can make a phenomenal amount of money um, with this particular ship um, so we will see how we go I'm not sure what that red flashing lights all about proximity ah, so they've changed where that is now little graphical increases. You've now got up on your um, left hand side you've got little message bars and stuff. Uh, settings quite easily to see. Uh, players online I'd imagine the next one is. It's all to do with making this more player friendly or multiplayer friendly I might add. Because uh, let's face it it's not massively multiplayer friendly at the moment. Um, which has been my main criticism of the game. Uh, when I played Frontier Elite 2, I believe, um, I was a big fan of the game and really, really, really enjoyed it. Um, but then got nothing more from this, really. Didn't really see the need, not the need, the, um, the progression, other than graphically, from the old game. And uh, because of that, um, I was a bit unsure of whether to uh, invest or not. So at the moment I can't see if my stream is actually working properly. It's going to come out by the nav beacon. Try and throttle back a bit. It's taking absolutely forever. And that'll be because I'm not actually clicked on the screen. Idiot. Stimpy, you idiot. There we go. This doesn't quite feel as agile as the uh, Viper. I thought the engines might sound a little bit different. But yeah, you think of this as a slightly bigger version, or slightly, quite a lot bigger version than the of the uh, Sidewinder, both made by the same shipyard, 
Um, so that would be it's the nearest thing that I'd say is like it. I'm trying to get this so it says life. Try reloading the whole thing. Oh. Here we go. So it doesn't arise too much of a delay. So currently I'm flying towards the nav beacon. Because that's where all the fun stuff happens. There. Oh, there is the actual navigation beacon. What are you? Baller. Dangerous. Official Everett flag. Means nothing to me. Don't know what that means. So I wonder. So there's more, there's more information than there was before now. Uh, wing, in wing two of two, Spartan, expert, clear. So those three are together. Oh, sorry, those two are together. Clean. Ah, so I'm guessing that's who they work for. Potentially. Clean. any sense. Why are you... Why are you able to shoot him and I'm not? Don't get it. Let's try again. There seems to be like a hell of a lot of fun going on over here and I can't get involved in any of it. Ah, there we go. I'll point out. Systems. He's going to be coming straight at me, I reckon. Did you 
just go bang. Hey, there we go, first man down. Scan detected. It's all a bit different. It's not necessarily different in a bad way, but it's just different. It'll take getting used to, wanted, here we go. Another expert, we'll see him. Sidewinder. Uh, I do a lot of reverse thrusting. going on here where I want to try and go faster so automatically you break your neck not gonna get away from me boy your ass is mine boom So I just spent quite a bit of money uh, actually sorting out my um, my ship. So I just bought this, which was an upgrade from the Viper because of the amount you can do with it. I believe that's the main reason for it being an upgrade. Uh, nicely harmless. Be wanted already. There we go. Um, so I spent about 600k on a ship in total. Scanning, scanning. Ideally, I'd like to do some work for the military soon. Hey, welcome to the stream. tend to be the uh, pirate's choice. More interested in the guy that's just hiding behind him. There's two of them there. This is nice now, there's wings. There's like some sort of formation to the guys coming in. That's it. Here we go. Oh, 
So at the moment there's only one of them, but they're in a wing. Under attack. So. Yeah, there you go. Too late for that, mate. Boom, you're down. Alright, where's this other idiot that decided to attack me? Under attack. Yeah, you will be. Guessing it's you. Silly boy. These guys too. Here we go. <laughs> In all sorts of trouble. Target destroyed. If you got any questions, feel free to chuck them in chat. Who is that shit? Oh, that's the Cobra Mark III. Oh, here we go. Target shields offline. playing this on a Xbox 360 controller. I've ordered the T Flight hot air system. Um, although my brother was trying to convince me to get the X55, I can't at this present moment in time warrant spending that sort of money. Where are you? Uh, you're turreted, aren't you? to scoop that stuff yet. I wonder if you can get a license to scoop rubbish because the ridiculous thing is, another ridiculous thing is, um, that you, you kill these bad guys and pirates or whatever you want to call them and then you can't scoop up the spoils of war. Which almost makes it pretty pointless to have a uh, cargo scoop uh, on any ship other than a mining ship. What have we got down there? It's like a rather large ship. Before I engage anything else, I should put some power to systems maybe. You're clean. You're clean. System authority vessels are going to be clean, aren't they? Really. Let's 
sun is absolutely beautiful. So let's just see what we've got in the uh, thing at the moment. <laughs> All that effort and only 8,000. Did I get damaged then? No. Hmm. Strange. I've uh, upgraded my armour so that if it does bleed through, I don't have too much of an issue. Scan detected. Who are you? Scan detected. Oh. Target shields offline. Eagles with no shield to spy so quickly. Oh no, he's not dead yet. Target shields online. And he's now got shields and they're boosted straight up. They should go straight down. Target shields offline. How much are you going to be for that? 12,000 boom. See anyone attacking me yet? More power to weapons, I feel. That's it. The shields on this seem to be holding up okay. And I wasn't expecting that at all, in most. Who's that going on over there? They were chasing somebody. There we go. Gunfire. Friendship charge detected. Oh. <laughs> He popped before I could even get to him. Scan detected. You scanning me now. Scan detected. Mm. So Still seen as a novice. Hmm, that's unfortunate. Let's head back to Nev Beacon. Hopefully, some of you lovely people that are viewing will actually say hello in a minute because it's getting lonely out here. Loads of guys behind that I've already scanned. Oh, there's an adder. That could be a good fight. Hee <laughs> This is going 
gonna be interesting. Here's some footage. Nope, there. It's very disorientating sometimes being in space. seem to be spinning aimlessly. Yeah, I think the game's crashed. No? Yes, no? What are you doing? Shoot this guy, I'm just messing with him. See how the AI reacts to different things. I can hear like gunfire going on. But I do not know where. Let's go back to the nav point. Which is an interesting idea because in the vacuum of space, do you hear? Do you actually hear the uh, sound? Mm. Let's get myself to around 100k. Oh, there's someone there. Where's he gone? That noise there sounds like the Cylons from uh, Battlestar Galactica. You would be, wouldn't you? Competent? Mm, let's check that, shall we? Alright, you should come straight at me. See how competent you are. So after a boost, there we go. That's it, perfect. We're gonna die. Oh, 
find my hand. Got a nice colour scheme on the eagle. Now the eagle has a much better turning circle than me, but because I'm a better pilot, I take advantage of the fact that I use forward and backwards thrust much more effectively. Jesus, this is a hell of a lot of system security vessels here. So, oh, I'll just see gunfire over there. Yeah, come on, let me blow up a nice fat transporter. What are you chasing? Yeah, I was chasing someone. Sometimes you don't even know that there's like ships until you just see them move slightly differently to a normal. Oh, we've got here. Sidewinder. Wanted. You're a dead man. Scan detected. Scan me all you want. You're dead and your buddy will be in a minute as well. Oh, mate. You've got no shields already. Bad move. Where are you going? There you are. Yeah. the unruly. <laughs> I sort of stole that kill, I'm not going to lie. Oh, these are much busier places now. Uh, David Lee, Master, are you clean? What are you, Sidewinder? Because one just flew out. Clean. 
So I'm a bit wary that someone that I might have just smashed to pieces has come back for vengeance. Darren Hobbs. Play. Clean. Okay, this is too far away for me to worry about the women. Right, one in engines. Alright. So what we're we looking at now. Do we think that we've got enough credits? Oh, they've got a local chat now. Blinding. Perfect. This has now become a much, much, much better game. start getting smashed to pieces. Yeah. 53 grand is not too bad. Let's just go to the Cleave hub because that's the nearest one. Lock this notion to see the Get my ass out of the way. Slow down, 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 slow down. Oh, doing the next thing again. Unbelievably quiet in chat tonight. Strange, usually it's uh, a bit noisier than this. Oh, I want to be that side of you. 
Boosting. I don't want to be asking. Take half. Fucking request. I do love the fact that you've got side thrusters and stuff. It does, it does make it so much nicer. Just manoeuvring around like that. Using your yaw and side thrusters. That is pretty much lined me up. Down goes the landing gear. Slows me down a little bit. Landing gear deployed. You should always try and enter on the green side. I'm looking for bay 12. Scan I can already detected. see that before I get in there. Which is nice. you land. Docking successful. Engines disengaged. So I want to go start on services and pay off that bounty before I uh, dock and get in trouble. Alright, so repair, repair, um, contacts. So your ship can get destroyed. I don't like that. I, I still don't like the fact that you might get an accidental bounty and all of a sudden your ship just goes pop. Eighty five grand. Um, compact bond, nothing. What have we got? Commodities market. Uh, <laughs> cargo space two. Thought I had more than that. <laughs> so there was a thing you used to be able to do in the old league where you used to just get uh, all the waste that you possibly could, fit it into. You could make loads of money just by getting uh, rubbish, effectively then go into some bio waste and just getting loads of it and then jettisoning it by a sun and just coming back and it was an easy way of making money to get yourself money in the first place. So in the old elite you started off with pretty much bugger all. It wasn't a great deal of uh, fun stuff you could do. Alright so let's see what we've got. Bulletin board. Quantity to cargo fish. Uh, a trending upsurge in fish age has opened up up junior analysis. You know, we are willing to pay for the transportation for test batch of fish in itself. Uh, I need to start working on. Yeah. So LHS four three seven. Walled Ridge Terminal accepts Alright, so let's just check I've got two fish and I need to go to I need to go to Contracts, transactions, fish delivery to Worldridge Terminal. I 
and I need to get the LHS three three four four seven. LHS three four four seven. See what's on here. There we go. Lock destination. Um, launch. Try and do something a bit different. You've seen the combat, so our oh, chances are I'll get chucked out of combat anyway. I've chucked out, and I'll have to do combat anyway. There we go, lock destination. Still in hyperdrive, I imagine. I haven't come out of it yet. And this will be the first uh, mission I've actually ever bothered doing. Because I never saw the point in them before. Uh, my brother now says that it's a good reason to do them to uh, my younger brother. Uh, who I actually go to for most of my computing needs um, I suggested that if I get a good few missions done you end up with more help when you're out in the battlefield and if I'm going to start playing in the multiplayer arena soon that will be something I massively need before I get in there I want to have this uh, pretty solid not an easy ship to kill and at the moment it's pretty goddamn easy I need to invest at least a million into this ship at least a million into this ship because why go for something that can't defend itself when this can have 60 cargo bay it can have some badass engines it can have some badass firepower on it and the medium gun slots as long as you've got it in the uh, So as long as you go to the correct system, sorry, then you can find that shit. Come on, hurry up. Baldridge is a long last terminal away. Much you do some trading. I know that trading increases your money much quicker in this game. Um, but it's not as fun. A lot of the fun in the old Elite was trying to find a good route and then using that and then finding a better one just by complete fluke and then building on that and getting yourself into a Tiger Trader and then carrying on or a Python Transport or wherever they were. Um, I am enjoying the game, don't get me wrong. It's a beautiful game. so much of the old, like the music for example, it's, it's not got the like the original stuff that used to make my hair stand on end, just the stuff for nostalgia's sake more than anything that I want 
to see. This is going to be a long ass stream. What's the time? I can't check the time on there. What's the time? Uh, I've got about another half hour of streaming. Um, if you are watching this, thank you for stopping by. I can't tell whether my Twitch has crashed or not. It only shows one person there. But it could only be one person watching. That might even just be me. It might even not be Twitch streaming properly. There could be all these different variations that are just screwing with me right now. But still. Usually I've had someone talk to me by now. I'm going a bit stir crazy talking to myself. But maybe I need to think of uh, a better playlist instead of this sh shit. Don't get me wrong, game um, soundtracks can be quite good. Eve Online soundtracks make the hair on the back of my neck stand up because, again, it's nostalgia. I've been playing Eve Online on and off since I was uh, 18. I'm now 32. I think it was 18, maybe 19. 2003, I started playing Eve Online. Um, I think that was a long time ago. 20. I would have been 20 when I first started playing EVE Online. It's crazy. It's a long time. This is the longest proxy terminal ever. actually going to take me two minutes to get there and you watch me overshoot it like an arsehole so it won't take me exactly two minutes it's what it'll do is it'll take me almost two minutes and then another minute and a half to get myself back round to a position where I should have been in the first place hmm Can't wait to get a bigger TV. Play this on. It's gonna be amazing. And I'll get my hot air set up. Probably this Friday. I'll be doing an unboxing of that. Um, the unboxings for the bits and bobs that went into this PC, unfortunately, are not to be because it was a rushed job to get them in before. Uh, yeah, before the wife got rid of them to be honest. She didn't like the idea that I was spending all this money on her PC. So I just decided to get my brother to build it quickly with me, get it running. I've got a new uh, cooler which I'll be unboxing and showing um, on the channel. Um, and that's, that's hopefully turn up Friday as well so it could be quite helpful. need someone to help me uh, set up my actual open broadcast settings because I don't think I'm getting the best setting standards hmm I think what I'll do is when I land at Wallage, Wallage. I'm terrible with reading. Wallage terminal. When I land at Wallage terminal, eventually, because it's just sitting there. At one minute, one second. So anyway, this thing going faster. Uh, no, that is as fast as it will go. actually naturally slowing down. I wonder if that's the pull of the sun directly behind me that's slowing me down. 
Yeah, it would be. Look, there's a big fuck off red sun behind me. There's another ship there as well. I always worry about these other ships when they're just sort of meandering around. Come on, release me from your gravitational pull. Taking ages. Taking ages. Oh, I might start drinking some Baileys or something on an extreme. Oh, makes it much more interesting when I'm drunk or something. But it is only Tuesday. Getting drunk on Tuesday is probably not the best idea. Especially when I have to go and work and be professional. Massively. Oh, this is going to annoy me. I knew it. It's not going to let me slow down, even though I've come in quite slow. I'm slowing down. God damn you. I think I could have predicted that any better. And these big, do you want to say big? These square epoxy docking bays are quite difficult. Oh. Multiple contacts around. I am slow. It's the gravitational pull that epoxy planet is doing me now. Here we go. Oh look at that, that looks pretty cool. Oh there you are. Docking request granted. Right. Which way is it? So much of this game is brilliant, so much of this game they missed from the original. That is beautiful. Look at that, you can actually see all the, the city that's on it. But, where's the, the docking music that you had from the original? Whoa, 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 whoa. 
landing gear deployed. Bit high, bit high, bit high. Oh, breathe in. Successful. I've got a big, I think engaged. I've got almost the biggest ship you can have in here because as soon as I get to the docking hangar, it uh, just I just get on the platform and it docks automatically. Uh, bulletin boards, cargo transport required. Is that the one? Deliver cargo. Yep. Keep cargo. Federal has no card. No, I'm not going to go and buy you weapons. It's an increased aggression by pirate ships in the following systems. Can you Ross Fortune okay. and it is impact on section on the moment. So 86,000 credits. Ooh. Let's just see what we've got on the trading tool. Before I start looking at stuff. Right, so I need to go to outfitting. Oh, what's in the shipyard? They said they've got some new ships. Eagle, Sidewinder, Type 6 Transporter, Adder. That's a pretty manoeuvrable ship, but it's just going to get melted, surely. Shield 60, 40.
Well, I can make money anyway, so if we go to internal. Thirty four K. Should have a decent sized cargo bay, really. Um, I'm a stickler for making sure everything's sort of neat, so I'm eventually going to sell that shield professor and chuck it somewhere else because I don't like things being split up. I like to be able to look and go blah 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 blah. Um, So I now have 32. station uh. so guys just uh, get a message from my good mate in Australia Calculators, what I want. Cargo capacity 32. Cash. Uh, 19k. Uh, minimum profit 500, max distance in light seconds, 25 light years. Start system L H S three four four seven end system any Port start station is Waldridge Terminal end system any calculate I can make 12 grand if I go to hmm. 
Well, it does eventually keep stacking up, I guess. Like right, 12 grand. What's that? Some of these haven't been updated in quite some time. So pick it up there, drop it off there. What am I buying? It's not working. That's not handy. So it is Lapidol Lights. Right, let's see if we've got some. Um, I think we've got a clue what Lapido Light is. stuff. Alright, so I need to head to Rish, which is probably not in the main menu. Should be within 25 light years. Two tons, jump range. Sweet. So I just keep going there. And I'll make 12k quickly. Not quite as quick as I was expecting, but hey. Double, I should be doubling my money. Which 
is always a good thing. Now when I first started playing this, this was a ridiculously hard thing to get used to. But now I've got it on. Engines engaged. Now I've got it on, it, like the controls sort of set perfectly to how I like them on the Xbox 3, uh, 360 controller. It's not too bad. I'm probably actually going to be a worse pilot with the hot air setup for the first little bit of time. Just because I'm not used to it. It's coming upside down. Everyone loves the Cobra, look at that bad boy. Right, so, there's you, FRT. Landing gear retracted. Change the fuel bar as well, so it's not blocked out now. Four, three, two, before it was one, blocked. Engage. Just these little minute changes, it's quite nice. This is all pretty high risk because I don't actually have the money to uh, pay for my ship to be repaired. Not repaired, bought back. I what that was then. key system as as possible. Well, I've got a full cargo load because they'll try and drop me out the frame shift as quick as they can and then they'll just blow me up for my ship. I'm going to increase the uh, strength of my shield somehow once I actually understand the shield system and 
when I'm getting better shields and when I'm not. Because uh, it's, it's, it's not 100% clear that you're getting that grade or not. Um, don't want to be on the nav beacon. I know that's where I am, but I'm really trying to avoid it. No. Frameshift drive charging. Hear the engine slow down. I'm like, oh, don't hold me here. Stuck in a gravity well. go to a place called Harbour Hub. What I might do is go to that system, do a few bounties, get my money up and then buy another 16 um, cargo, cargo bay expander, for want of a better word. Uh, and uh, then Start doing some bigger trading. Get myself some monies. Get myself a deck tower. Badass ship. Saw myself calling out. Whoa, he's creeping up. Come on. Taking heat damage from. That was just weird. Alry Sector Junior. Allied LTT order. Hmm. Won't be staying around here long. Friendship drive charging. But you don't want to keep seeing my big fat fingers. Four, How am I overheating? few things. What the hell? Like an effect of getting all these strange noises coming out of my machine. Right, that's what it was. 
I accidentally knocked it off when I was trying to see why it was damaged because I keep getting heat damage and I don't know what from. Heat seems to be fine on everything. Controls. Let's try and find secondary. It's quick. Secondary fire, I will use that. Apply. There's a star there. It's a bit of exploring while I'm here. That's the star. in the area. Not there yet. I thought I was there. Ah, that'll be why. Friendship drive. There's me thinking I'm already there.
So I need to go. That one. That destination, and then I will explore this area. Oh, you're that close, Jesus. Makes me think I'll have to go absolute miles. station is this? Ooh. I believe I probably need to be about 7k for this one before I ask for docking shooting so I think this may be my last for the day docking successful engines disengaged sell all my goodies right so it says I should be selling for 818 here Thirty-one thousand, um, ten percent of what I was at the start of the day. Uh, let's see what else they've got here while I'm looking. Oh, I might be able to sell some shit here. There we go. Bulletin board, naval progression opportunity. I don't supply shit, I transfer shit. Don't supply shit. Uh, discrete cleaner needed for low key engagement. Interesting, but I'm not going to go with any of this today.
I need to head to Kick it off the L U G H Wish uh, Traffic Report. Nice bounty already. So, if I'm now in Rish, and I have joking me nothing like it. oh there we go I'm still only 11 I think, guys, I'm just going to quickly go to the uh, nav beacon. Ship released. Engines engaged. Got there, and then once I know what we've got there, cannot comply. Landing gear retracted. Frameship drive charging.
you're slowing down, you bastard. Dropping me out and attacking me. <sighs> right, where was I going? Oh, might as well do this now. I've been dropped out somewhere. No. How did that happen anyway? I was barely Cannot had comply. any chance to go where I wanted to go. fun because I wanted to kill people anyway. Fuel scoop gone down. So that one cannot comply. Uh, four. at the moment and it's still not being slow enough. Businesses like
Clean. Clean. Just going to clean. Need the same guy from earlier? Yeah. Hmm. No, well, seems everyone's law abiding here. Or well, maybe not. Who are you? Why are you hiding down there? I think I'm gonna finish the stream there as I can't find anything to kill. Um, thank you for joining the stream. Um, or thank you for tuning in and watching this on YouTube. Uh, I've been Muddy Gamer. It's been a long ass stream, so I don't think many of you will get to the end. Um, this is Elite Dangerous. It's the new patch that's come out, which is. It's made a lot of the uh, the things that were necessarily I wouldn't say broken but missing gone. Like they're back now, so like you can now talk in local chat, which is a big thing for me. I've been discussing with a few of the other guys. I'm not quite sure what else we've got up here, if I'm honest. Um, where's my mouse? Let's try. I can't get through it right now. Um, but it, it would seem that it's a, a much more multiplayer orientated game now, whereas before it just really wasn't. It was Frontier with a few nice graphical bits and bobs to it. It's, it looks like he's accelerating quite hard. What's he doing? He's dying is what he's doing. Yeah, damn straight they're offline, you're getting absolutely owned. Stupid boy. Target destroyed. Didn't get time to even get on that. That dude's got a beam laser. Shoot, you know. Ah, you're still going to be getting involved aren't you? I love you before I sign off. Beam lasers. Oh, there you go, 12k. Okay. Nice. He's still playing, which is cool. This game is so addictive. Right, so. I might actually put up a how to on the control system that I use. Um, just a brief overlook would be pitch and roll, throttle up, so throttle up, throttle down, and your left and your right, and then the other buttons are pretty much however you desire. But I'll do a quick overview of that uh, because this does make playing Eve Elite Dangerous, not Eve, 
Elite Dangerous a hell of a lot easier the mouse and keyboard um, so yep I've been Muddy Gamer thank you for stopping by on either YouTube or sitting, but sitting and watching me on Twitch um, hope you've enjoyed watching it if you do please like and subscribe um, on YouTube or follow me on Twitter and uh, stay tuned for the next one see you then Au revoir.